We believe that 99% of all living species that have ever inhabited the planet have disappeared, never to be seen again. At first sight, that might sound incredibly alarming, and in many ways it probably should. However, the act of extinction is quite a natural phenomenon and part of natural evolution. What isn't natural is the contribution mankind is now having and the speed at which species are regularly vanishing around the globe. In this, our latest video, we're taking a look at the top 10 animals that have gone extinct in the 21st century and the increasing speed of what is known as the sixth mass extinction. But before we do, don't forget, be sure to hit the red subscribe button below and ring the bell to make sure you never miss our latest videos. Okay, so as always, let's start off with our number 10, the Penta Tortoise. Penta Island is part of the world-famous Galapagos Islands, located off the coast of Ecuador in the Pacific Ocean. This particular species of giant tortoise was first recorded by Captain James Colnett in 1798, but formally recognized and named by Albert Gunther in 1877. Scientists actually believed the Penta tortoise to have gone extinct by the end of the 19th century, but a single tortoise was subsequently discovered in 1971. The last remaining Penta tortoise was named Lonesome George, and despite many attempts to get George to mate with other closely related tortoise species, he was never able to reproduce successfully. George finally passed away in 2012, bringing an end to the line of this unique and ecologically important herbivore. Our choice at number 9 takes us from the Pacific to the North Atlantic in the eastern seaboard of the United States and Canada, where we once might have found the Eastern Cougar. This subspecies of wildcat has been listed as endangered since 1973 and was finally notified as extinct in 2011. As with virtually all the instances of extinct creatures on our list, interaction with humans seems to have been the main cause of their disappearance as a species. Destruction of their natural habitat where humans have built new housing, roads, and other kinds of infrastructure, along with regular confrontation with farmers over killing their livestock, rapidly assisted the decline of yet another North American big cat. For number 8, we're going to take a trip to the other side of the planet where only a few years ago we might have found the Yangtze River Dolphin. Also known as the Baiji, the Yangtze River Dolphin was confirmed as extinct in 2007 and is the first species of dolphin brought to extinction by mankind. As the name would suggest, this small, long-nosed freshwater dolphin lived in the once fast-flowing waters of the Yangtze River in eastern China. Overfishing in the regular wild fish stock of the Yangtze meant less food for the dolphins, but many were also killed as a result of by-fishing, getting caught up in the illegal nets and being drowned. Huge dams built across the river have also meant the aquatic species like the Baiji were not able to find food where they would once have normally done so. Number 7 keeps us in China, and indeed the Yangtze River as we take a look at the story of the Chinese paddlefish. Once one of the world's largest freshwater fish species, the Chinese paddlefish has been known to grow up to 7 meters in length but was last officially seen in 2003 and finally declared extinct in 2020. Scientists believe the fish had managed to survive everything from the extinction of the dinosaurs to countless other natural effects and challenges thrown at it during that period of time. Despite all that, and like many other species we're highlighting today, it couldn't fend off the threat from mankind. Overfishing and the damming of the Yangtze in the 1980s were its final straw in the battle to live on. Our next port of call is Europe, where our number 6, the Pyrenean Ibex, used to call home. By definition, extinction should only be a one-time event, but not in the case of the Pyrenean Ibex, or Bucardo. Technically, the world's last surviving Bucardo was killed when a tree fell on her in January of 2000. But three years later, and in total secrecy, a Spanish laboratory cloned the Pyrenean Ibex, which they managed to effectively birth, but which died after only a few minutes. Quite why it took five years for the Spanish governmental agency in charge to come clean, we don't know. Maybe they'd watched Jurassic Park too many times. Why do we know that this particular species of wild ibex will not have a third attempt at life ever again? Hunted to destruction from the peak of over 500,000 animals only a few decades ago, the Pyrenean ibex population has been destroyed for man's love of trophies, in this case, its incredible horns. Our first of the top five takes us back to the Far East for a look at the Formosan Clouded Leopard. Not seen anywhere on the former Chinese island of Taiwan since 1983, the Formosan cloud leopard has been declared extinct since 2012. Along with the Formosan black bear, the species of leopard has long been regarded as an animal of incredible importance by a number of indigenous tribes living in the region that the Formosan clouded leopard would normally call home. Unfortunately, others didn't hold the same opinion, and like many other wild cats the world over, the leopard had been hunted to extinction just to allow an elite few to wear its skin as a fashion statement. 
Number four was once a native of the Hawaiian island of Maui, the black-faced honeycreeper. Last seen in the wild in 2004 and officially declared extinct in 2018, the black-faced honeycreeper, or Powauli as it is known locally, used to inhabit the eastern side of the island where it was commonly much wetter than other parts. More indirectly as a result of human intrusion into its natural habitat, the black-faced honeycreeper appears to have been the victim of disease and invasive species as much as destruction of its normal mountain rainforest location by man. Nevertheless, the last example of the Poali died in captivity in 2004. At number 3 is the Alautra grebe. Endemic to the shallow and brackish waters in the Lake Alautra in Madagascar, the Alautra grebe appears to have last been seen in 1982 and has now been classified as officially extinct by the IUCN. There may be a number of reasons for the disappearance of this particular species of grebe, including destruction and degradation of its natural shorelines along the lake that the birds may well have used for nesting purposes, and the introduction of an invasive carnivorous fish that likely took most of the fish that the grebe itself would normally have fed on. Being an effectively flightless bird, the Elotra grebe would not have been able to look for other locations in which to potentially prosper. Number two on our list of animals that have gone extinct in the 21st century is the Vietnamese Javan rhino. The last ever Javan rhino was shot and killed by poachers for the ivory of its horn in April of 2010. The female rhino was the last ever to roam the wild in Vietnam and means that the Vietnamese Javan rhino is now the second of this particular type of rhino to go extinct. As with many illegal wildlife kills, the main reason for killing the animal in the first place is the false view that the rhino's horn can cure diseases such as cancer, or more ridiculously as a way to treat a hangover. In actual fact, rhino horns are made up of nothing more than the same thing that makes up our own fingernails and hair. So our final entry for the most recently extinct animals is the western black rhinoceros. Once widely seen in the sub-Saharan African region, the western black rhinoceros was finally declared extinct in 2011 by the IUCN. Amazingly, the western black rhinoceros has been the subject of a fairly successful preservation program put together in the 1930s. However, for reasons unknown, the conservation and protection of this particular rhino lapsed and allowed poachers to once again kill large numbers in order to get their horns, which as we've seen with the Javan rhino we discussed previously, was for reasons that hold no value in science. But with a monetary value of up to $50,000 a kilo in Africa, and double that in the Far East, it's not difficult to understand why poachers do what they do. So, having survived all kinds of environmental and natural challenges over the 7 to 8 million years that the animal was in existence, it could not hold out against the excessive hunting by humans. Well, that's it for our top 10 animals that went extinct in the 21st century. Thank you for watching. It's been fun having you with us. Did you agree with our picks? Let us know in the comments and be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to get notifications about our latest videos. We'll see you again soon.